guys hello long crafts here and today's time to start harvesting i've already started harvesting but i have a good reason for why i didn't make a movie about this these are all my buttercup squash butternut squash got a couple of zucchinis and cucumbers and a couple of peppers they all came out of this garden here except for that one green pepper but last night there was a frost warning so last night i think it was around 10 o'clock at night and i got my lights wired up my tractor so i drove in here with my tractor you can see my tracks right over in through here and these vines right here and those vines and these ones right there those were all buttercup squash the ones that are in my trailer I picked through here all last night and i'd say i got them all picked drove right through here right through my swiss chard roll there's no swiss chard there anyway and come over here and all right there was all my butternut squash and there's still some of them that aren't uh, quite mature yet so i didn't pick them but any of them that were mature just in case the frost got them i picked them uh, as many as i could there and my zucchini hill over here, I picked three zucchinis there just in case something did happen to them. I would have a few of them, but they're all okay. You see their uh, leaves are starting to die, so they're pretty near done for the year anyway. And here's my dad's cucumber hill. Well, I planted them, did everything. He bought the cucumbers, the plants. But, so those were our cucumbers. And then this big squash hill here, these were all vines. These were all buttercup squash that my grandmother and my uncle picked a couple days ago. And I'm going to take my trailer load up and get a picture of all my squash and the stuff that I grew and all their squash all together. Alright guys, so I went up and got my picture of all our stuff together. You guys will see it'll probably be my thumbnail. So the next thing I'm going to do is i got to unload all my squash. And right here, there, there, all along here, these are all potatoes. So I'm going to go unload my trailer and I'm going to load all these potatoes up and yeah. guys that's what I ended up with all my potatoes dug all the way down there there were a few there that no gut and down here I got a few down here but I mean that was pretty good you guys seen the row I mean it was just hit and miss it was probably only half a row because I'm gonna turn my tractor and load the potatoes in my into the bunk crate I guys get all the potatoes loaded up and I was thinking I know what I'm having for supper tonight <coughs> I got them fresh potatoes my Swiss chard all down here, the deer ate it, but it all came back real good. It all came back real good. And I got all them squash and some deer meat, so it's been a pretty good supper. And before the end of the video, I just wanted to give you the guys a little update on my zucchinis over there. Alright guys, the zucchinis are just doing great. Their uh, vines are starting, or their uh, plants or whatever you want to call it, are starting to die. But the zucchinis all did very well. You guys, I want you guys to let me know what I should do with all of these. Because even though you can see like all the ones I have in here, oh, where was the um, there are still more coming. There's that one, there's oh, like a full grown one. There's that one there. I have no idea what to do with these. Like, do you look at them all in through here? And there's another hill over there. There's about 60 or 70 of them. And I don't know what to do. And I can pick them all, like squash, just have them there, but they don't keep like one to five days after I picked them. And each one of these needs graded. So, yeah, there's a lot of time involved, like, you need a couple of days off if you want to pick all these and grade them and freeze them. But once they're graded and frozen, then you keep and make whatever you want all winter, but a lot of work getting like that. But anyways, guys, um, make sure you let me know how you like the video, dig on the potatoes, all the squash, and update on the zucchinis. Make sure to rate, comment, subscribe, and see you in the next video.